Oh my god, is it already recording? Oh, yes. Oh. You guys, I don't know what happened, but. All of a sudden it hurts so fucking bad. I don't know what happened, but it's like it's been like ten minutes now. And it hurts so bad. Right now it's burning. I've been sitting here like, oh my god, right now it fucking hurts. And it's stuck to my finger. And it fucking when I did it, I was screaming. I was like, Mother, this hurts even right now. It hurts. What the hell? This is just not cool. This is just like right now I'm in so much pain. This can't be it was super glue, but it's just like all squirted out at once and it stuck this to my finger. I'm always fighting over the fingernail, my thick fingernail teeth. I was full of super glue. It's so uncomfortable. I just don't. You know, it's like. You guys, it's so soft. I'm doing up again. Tell you, but it's really embarrassing. I don't really want to, but this fucking hurts. What the fuck does this mean? This ain't cool. This thing is super cool. My finger, I tried to get it off and under the water. It fucking. It, this hurts so bad. It just hurts so bad. It's like, right now I can't do nothing about it. And it's there. And it's like. It's, it's hurting me. It's hurting. It's hurting. I don't like this. I know I'm dramatizing about something. But I'm telling you, this shit's not cool. <laughs> For me, because I always every day have a battle with a super glue every day. I have it in my teeth. I'm always trying to. Because I think the real teeth. <laughs> you know, it was like this, you know. This is not how I'm creative to be. Look at this, you guys. I know you're going to think I'm ugly now. You guys are going to think oh, she's an ugly mother, but you know what? Look at this. This is not me. I was not created to be like this, and neither were you. This is not me. This is not you. We're falling apart. We're dying. We're growing old. We're sick and we're hurting. And then we die. Look at this. This is not me. You. Everything that's hurting you, it's, it's trust me, what you are before you think right now is not you. Outside, I'm telling you, it's a lie. It's a fucking lie. We weren't created to be like this. Homer did not create us like this. I just have to go like, go and spin in the super glue. You know, but <laughs> my only queen I'll ever be is a drama queen. Um, but now it don't hurt as bad, but it still really, really hurts. Like the whole thing is super glue. It just went on my finger and the key too. I'm gonna go ahead and do this video with no key. I I don't want to do it a few times, but I was really embarrassed. And I still am ashamed. And I feel so ugly, and I know that I can never even, I don't even fantasize about sex or anything, because I don't have no, you know, I mean, I don't even think about it, because it's like, any guy or anybody I think about that I would feel embarrassed, but them, because if they knew about it, they'd be sick thinking about, you know, I feel like, I don't even think about sex or anything, because I know that I, no man will ever, because you know what, I wouldn't want, if I, you know, this is not me, I wouldn't want to, me either like this i mean it'd be like i can see how i can try to love the inside of me oh but the, the, this part though i have to tell you it just would turn me off it would and i've gained i gained like i've gained like almost 15 pounds that's a really bad effect but because you know it's like testing baby but you know it's like to be beautiful inside and outside and to be healthy, and to radiate, and to flow, and to be able to like, you know, just like float over buildings and mountains. You ever seen that, um, Chris, whatever, the magician that levitated above the Luxor and stuff, he, Chris Angel, he's fucking stupid because he fucking told a bunch of his tricks, sold out to the fucking money and shit. I know you guys are going to think I'm super ugly this time, but I feel like it. I know it. I already have to look at myself like this. Anyhow, the Tesla energy. The Luxor is the brightest light in the world, okay? The brightest light in the world. And it's a talisman, and it's where the reptilians are storing a bunch of human souls when they push them out of their body and take over their body. That's what they're doing. But the Tesla energy right there, it's, it's the brightest light in the world, which means that there's no other... Oh, this hurt. There's no other light in the world that has the energy except just the pyramid here, the Luxor. It's the Tesla energy. Okay, this world is completely masculine energy. Boom. 
masculine energy is not bad. It's a wonderful thing. But the, the feminine, the, the, the feeling, the emotion, uh, um, ecstasy, eroticism, mysticism, just, uh, oh, oh, it hurts. It really hurts. And so, in order to make our world happy so we can all, like, just have our cake and eat it, too, you know, then we have to let the sacred feminine back in. Yeah. Look. <laughs> oh, guess what? You want to see something really cool? The super glue? You know, like my cavities? Check this out. I have total deficiency defective in my genetics. Because this tooth... It like turns into like a tusk. It's like a runaway tooth, like a tusk. Look at that. There you go. <laughs> and I, twice, I was like, oh my god, like a fucking elephant. You know, a tusk. You're like, I'm growing a fucking tusk. Oh my god, how can I be growing a tusk? <sighs> and then, with the super glue, or like cavities, you know, like I had some cavities, and now it broke them off. The super glue. And like, that's one good thing is it broke all my cavities off. Oh god, this fucking hurts. I can't get this off without ripping my whole finger off. It's really that bad. I went into serious. I mean, the whole super glue, I mean, that thing is just like, it's like a big, it just it hurts me. And every day I eat it. I was always, I'm always, every single day, doing this. That's all I do all day long. And I'm digging, digging, trying to work it all day. My hands are always in my fucking mouth trying to get the super glue off. <laughs> I just was gonna like hang up right now, but I was thinking, I don't know. <laughs> Are you guys happy? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so weak. Baby, you're gonna be so weak. I don't wanna be weak. It's a mess again, so I'm always tearing it down and putting it back together and tearing it down. Willie, William Momor, he always he told me that he would be a turtle when I asked him. What kind of he would be, what kind of animal he'd be a turtle? Because it holds up the world. William was kicked out of the Hells Angels because they thought that he was telling me things and he didn't tell me anything ever. Ever. Fucking ever. Okay, the other Hells Angels, I don't know how many have been kicked, or kicked out in trouble by now because we need to. Wayne was the only one. Wayne was the only one that never opened his mouth. Out of all of them. Did Pee Wee get kicked out? Because when I called the clubhouse and talked to that one dude that was my friend, and now all of a sudden he's calling me looking cut and a piece of shit and told me to go never call again all of a sudden. You know, because he was talking with me for a while. He used to be William's friend, good friend. But when you get kicked out of the Hells Angels, if you have a tattoo, a Hells Angels tattoo, you. They burn up a blowtorch. Just out. William got his whole entire back done. Okay? I don't know where it is. I just know that I cannot shake this feeling that something's wrong. William Howard Rowan is in trouble. And when we were together, I swore to him, you know what I told him? I remember this clear as day. I said, if somebody kidnapped you or hurt you, ever took you away, or you were out in the middle of nowhere in a dungeon or something and they were hurting you and nobody knew where you were, I told them, I go, I swear you, I'll find you. And I remember saying that. I said it to him a couple times. I don't know why I said it, but I just, I meant it. But then I was like, I meant it. Troy Regas. Hurts. This hurts bad. What do you think I should do? You think I should rip it off on camera just so we can get some viewers? Because nobody's watching my videos anymore. I guess everybody's getting sick of looking at rocks and pictures. But I put magic in it. Everything. Every single video I make, I put magic in it. Love so that you guys will, every time you watch it, get more of your powers and energies and memories and help feel better. Oh, this hurts. <laughs> this really hurts. Well, I do, you guys. Oh, it hurts. It's going to be stuck in me all day. And the day I moved to the floor, you know, I have them. I fucking stick to teeth and super glue. I super glue. The night that I got their test, 
the little stone the night he broke off and named the paintings Veritas Truth you know um, oh. that night <laughs> right before Chance name you know come out with a name I super glued my three fingers together like this Right. Wait, it was like that. And I could not, it was like this. And I could not get the super glove. I had to walk around like that like for four hours, five hours. Remember Jesus, how he does that in pictures, he's doing this? My fingers were super glued like that. And I was like, I'll never do this again. I swear I'll never go through this again. <laughs> this is the one that named the pain Veritas. And Veritas means truth. And I remember hearing that the truth will set us free. But look at his little bed. I gave him to Jennifer, but um, J but he wanted to come back. <laughs> yeah, he wanted to come back, and Jennifer told me. She's like, well, you know, because she's... The stones are alive. See? Oh, my finger. <laughs> this little bed. <laughs> Veritas. 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 Veritas, 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 I didn't name, I didn't know that, but all Jennifer's paintings, over 200 of them, Veritas, a 15 year old boy named this painting, just broke off of Aquamarine. And she has picked it up 15 years old. He had it for like three hours before I knew it. And then he told me about it. And he told me, it's a boy. And he said, it told him its name. I still can't remember. But then I wanted to name my painting the same thing. I go, tell me the name again. Because I really wanted to hear it, but he wouldn't say it again. And so, and he told me, he goes, that's not. Because I go, I've been looking for a name for my painting for so long. And I have to paint it. Because Jennifer gave me this. This is my first bit. This is Veritas. This is. These are the secrets of the grail. Chance named this. He wrote this on the back here. I've never even knew the name Veritas. And I met Truth. Truth. I know I'm very, I need to work, my coordination will get better someday if I survive this, I don't know, maybe not, maybe I'll can't do it by myself, I gotta do it by myself, I'm not going, I gotta go, no I'm not going at all.